After an alien spaceship crash lands into a small town, a trio of neighbors conspire to keep their new extraterrestrial visitor a secret in the sci-fi drama, Jewels. I think that we ought to change our town slogan. A great place to call home is confusing. I suggest a great place to refer to as home. <clears throat> and also... Oh my. Use these stories which are about somebody starting to lose some faculties later in life are sad and heavy and uh, somewhat melancholic, and this wasn't. When I first read the script for Jules, my initial reaction when I put it down was, this is the sweetest script I've ever read in my entire life, and I really want to be a part of this. A UFO has crashed in my backyard has taken out my azaleas and destroyed my birdbath. You blended with a ridiculous humor, a wild inventiveness, a slight science fiction element, and a four foot 11 inch alien. Those things don't usually go together in one movie. When you talk like that, it makes them all take us less seriously. Did you just say UFO? Part of the secret sauce of the screenplay is the character of Jules, played by Jade Kwan who says nothing. And yet she is the perfect listener that we all wish we knew. Jade is the most professional, easygoing, ethical, sweet, nice, fun, lovable, talented. She made this job easy and fun. May I touch her? She shouldn't know. We gotta trust her. There's nothing else we can do. You're gonna kill her. The design actually came from KNB Effects in, in um, LA. Uh, Howard Berger called me and they had done the initial designs and they called me and they said, hey, can you take this? They sent me the drawing that they had done. It was exactly as friendly as this alien needed to be. Once I got a hold of that design and started staring at it, then I got to sit there for a day and go, okay, how many molds do we have to make? How many sculptures is this? How are we breaking it down? If I look back at old uh, movies from the 60s and 70s, even the 50s, and I looked at the aliens and they all sort of have that same kind of grayish tone. So we use that as our model. Dad, come on. I'm worried. What you have said has not been normal. I'm okay. How can you say that when you're buying apples for an alien? There's an element of depth to it, which I am immediately drawn to, and then the humor. It just, it just immediately caught me. So those things don't usually go together. Uh, and to keep it grounded, it's critical that the actors played it straight, which they did. We're so thankful for you. you got me. Hey guys, thanks for checking out this video. We want to know what would you have asked? Let us know in the comments below. And if you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button. And as always, for more videos like this, hit the MIH TV logo right here. And for the next awesome video, click right there.